Robbins there at the Vatican moderating and participating in a conference about the stem cell research that could potentially save lives. Hey, Robin, tell us about this conference you're at right now. Well, buongiorno, Michele. Good morning, Michael, from here at the Good Vatican morning. City. And it's really... <laughs> I knew that you couldn't resist. It has been something else being here at the Vatican talking about stem cell research. And I'm so honored to be asked to share my story. And with my sister, Sally Ann, my big sister, Sally Ann, many of you are aware that she was my bone marrow donor back in 2012. She is here along with one of my doctors from Memorial Sloan Kettering back in New York. Dr. Sergio Geralt, and so we were just sharing everything that we have gone through in this journey, and people are very excited. Tomorrow, hello, tomorrow, Vice President Joe Biden will be addressing this conference. You know about his Moonshot Initiative, and of course, we're also going to have an audience with the Pope, but it's really been remarkable, the strides that are being made and the real advances that we are seeing in these um, medical advancements. Robin, you're so calm with all that commotion behind <laughs> you. you know, I know. <laughs> that was a remarkable live shot. <laughs> well, you know, after, you, after you've been one, after you've been through what I've been through, so you know, what's a little, you know, little, 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 little yeah. And we all do remember you were at the Vatican just two weeks before your stem cell transplant. Right. It must be so moving to be back. Uh, many of you there, George, Lara, Amy, Michael, you guys remember. You remember so uh, incredibly well. And it was just weeks before I was going to have the transplant. And I came here to the Vatican and, and, and said a prayer that I would be able to have the strength to um, face whatever it is, whatever the outcome was going to be. And, and this whole conference, guys, which really is, is very interesting, it's that balance between science and faith, how science interfaces with faith and vice versa. And I have to say, and you know this, when I said to you all, hey, I'm going to the Vatican and we're talking about stem cell research and advances, and you're like, the Vatican and stem yeah, cells. Yeah, amazing. Uh, Pope Francis, yeah, yeah, Pope Francis. And you know, we're talking about immunotherapy, and, and Larry, I know you have a friend yep. who's been going through that. And so these are t of the types of advances that we are seeing that are making a true difference. And I can't wait to share more with you yeah. throughout the morning. It sounds fascinating. We can't wait either, but thank you, Robert.